my eyes are burning a lot ah just because i was watching a k drama the whole the entire day ah by the way it was extraordinary attorney wu and guys uh, welcome to my channel uh, first of all we are really close to 500 subscribers like right now it's 499 and you can see the glow like, like no it's not the glow because uh, I was watching something, I was watching a K-drama the entire day and now I'm feeling so sick because I was watching the screen. Okay, now back to the point. Today, I am going to share my opinion, my review, my experience, my thoughts about this. So this is uh, the Face Shop uh, Rice Water Bright uh, Rich Cleansing Oil. This is how it is looks this 150 ml product and the price is 1190 but you can always grab it at like a really cool discount and right now like i bought it from foxy and i got it i think uh for rupees 7.99 or yeah something like this it is uh sls free it has no silicone or paraben but it is not fragrance free which is like it, it, it is a I, I would say a plus point and a minus point for some people but for me i think the uh, fragrance thing is plus point because it smells like so good so floral the version uh, for normal to dry skin and they have another version for oily skin though uh, i don't know like in cleansing oil there are differences everything is pretty much same and you can uh, use it up to 12 months so there is a logo yeah 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 focus i'm for yeah whatever so i'll put an image over here uh, after opening you need to finish this within 12 months but i don't i don't know if i'm gonna finish it within 12 months or not because uh, i have few facts to talk about this uh, particular product like really i love face shop products uh, they are uh, sheet masks are amazing though i don't prefer sheet masks nowadays uh, you know they are literally too much wastage for our environment uh, but they their products are good they are good but i have some mixed feeling about so this you can product. see like um i i bought it a while ago i, I i've shown it in my foxy haul also I, I bought it literally a while ago but i think i have used it for uh, two three three times or four times maximum and it is so runny and it it, it literally it is like water and it has this kind of stopper and uh, this is the nozzle when you use one pump it kind of dispenses a lot of product and that's it but the thing is if you have uh, i don't know uh, if i should say this in the beginning of the video or not if you have acne prone skin or you are prone to acne or breakouts i would say you can avoid this one but you have pretty much normal skin and you don't get that much acne uh, then try it because it is cheap and it is effective and it it literally melts your makeup and the fragrance is delicious though if fragrance is like if fragrance is an issue for you then i would say um, don't buy it because the smell the fragrance lingers for hours and even after washing your face with proper uh, second cleanser it the fragrance is gonna stay on your face like for a really long time and you can see the ingredient lists over here uh, that what it has so they claim face shop claims that it can basically uh, brighten up your skin and like what i'm gonna uh, it has rice rice extracts but apart from that uh, like for how long you use your cleansing oils you don't like leave it for overnight like really we maximum use uh, and put the cleansing oils on our face for maximum uh, few seconds to a minute maximum and i don't think like a product can like brighten my skin up within one minute how is this possible and yeah it like a product like salicylic acid kind of cleansers they can't like work if you use it for like one minute straight uh, for your skin on your skin but uh, if you are gonna use this every single day then I don't know but I feel like um, something like this like it claims to cl brighten up your skin because it has right uh, rice extracts um, uh, don't do this because I, I don't think brightening thing like you can get brightness from uh, one minute cleansing oil 
vitamin C is there, niacinamide is there, so let them do their work and let the uh, cleansing oil do his work. So, yeah. I have a friend over here. How you doing? Okay, so now let's talk about my overall experience and if I like it or not and how is the feeling. First of all, with this cleansing oil, you definitely need a lot. Uh, you really need a lot. And this is really lightweight. Uh, this is a really lightweight formula, but the moment you use it on your face, it, it it becomes uh harsh a bit harsh because i have few i have personally used other cleansing oils or cleansing balms but they don't feel like there is no harshness in those products but in this particular product i i definitely feel the harshness yeah it does melt your makeup effectively it emulsifies pretty fast but the only con is that when i rub this on my face i see i i don't know if, if it's a fact for only for me or i do i feel or personally i don't know but i have seen the harshness i have felt the harshness on my skin the <laughs> another yeah. con would be if you are using this you definitely need pretty strong the like the strongest kind of second cleanser to remove that oil from your face because uh, if i use this first of all uh, i personally don't mind the cleansing oils that left a film uh, uh, like a film of oil on my face personally uh, like some cleansing balms uh, like uh, do that nowadays like the plum one it like literally left a film on my face but when i use my second cleanser the film kind of goes away and i don't f feel any kind of uneasiness and uncomfortableness like, like no it's all okay but with this king uh, I think it should be a queen but I don't know with this king uh, my normal face wash is not enough even I am putting a lot of face wash and I'm rubbing my face it, it my, my face wash doesn't even foam up you know the DHC powder face wash like it foams up crazily if I use uh, this cleansing oil that even the DHC powder face wash doesn't foam up like literally it doesn't foam up so uh, I, I I need to wash my face twice first one is this and the second two round is my normal foaming face wash but I have to use it twice uh, to remove the uh, oil from my face completely because it doesn't uh, let my other foaming face washes to foam up easily and effectively and uh, that's why um, I don't know I, I, I might never pre-purchase this one ever again and if you are thinking of buying this trying this for the first time I'd say yeah if you if you don't have acne prone skin you can uh, buy this because uh, the moment whenever I use it I occasionally got one or two bumps on my face it, I know it's not an issue but uh, for my skin I don't get the bumps usually on my face only because if i use a bha i got a purging sometimes but uh, i see when i use this i definitely saw some bumps on my face i don't know like i i need to try this for a couple of more times but i can say only that much for like till now and uh, uh, coming back to the harshness uh, uh like i don't know if, if it's a fact for you too or if you if you have felt the harshness uh, please let me know because i don't know if this is only a my think or you have felt it too third thing is um, if you have the budget you can try another other cleansing oils or cleansing balms uh, personally I, I, I'd say I, I gave it a 6 out of 10 and my personal my favorite uh, cleansing oil is this DHC cleansing oil I, I know it's my second bottle uh, though I couldn't finish the first one it's in my bathroom and i don't know i pick this any day over this like this is my love and it is not harsh it just it, it just melts my makeup in a like a dream and it doesn't leave anything behind like a trace of oil behind and that's why i love this it's not in promotion or something but i i genuinely love this when it comes to this one it does remove makeup effectively but it emulsifies pretty fast but the thing is uh, that oiliness I just cannot take the oiliness and I just cannot wash my face uh, twice to remove the oiliness that it gave me every time so uh, I, I don't think I'm gonna rep <laughs> I can't, like I need to finish this within one year and I have only used it like for like 
for fourth time yeah for four or five times and i don't know how i'm gonna finish it maybe i will wash my brushes or uh, i'll do something else but um i i did not like it on my face honestly all right so that's all from my side and let me know your experience if you have used it or if you are using it or if you are thinking of buying it uh, let me know anything and yeah that's all for today if you like this video then don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe because we are gonna cross 500 subscribers in no time and i just cannot wait to see the 500 subscriber stamp like uh I, I i have been shooting and making videos since november 2021 and it's august 2022 and uh, i don't see much improvement though i'm really gonna continue doing youtube so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video don't forget to drink a lot of water and bye